I'm Peter Haddock and I'm on top of the hydrogen wheel loader from Liebe. Hans, you're joining me here to talk about this fantastic machine here, the highlight of the Liebe press conference. Hans, <laughs> what have we got? What have we stood on here? What's the capacity of this machine? This is a typical 24 ton wheel loader. Yep. And so we chose this for starting with hydrogen because here we have high energy demand that makes hydrogen very interesting. And also we have good production volumes so that we have a good impact when starting with this machine. So folks, the brilliant thing about this is that we are working big shifts on this, aren't we? Yes. We're not just standing around. So what's the capacity of the hydrogen that can come into this uh, machine? And also how much capability for hours working will that give that machine? Yeah, the idea is that we can do one shift with one tank. So this will be approximately eight to 10 hours. And then we can do the fast refueling and it is fit again for the next shift. And the big news today, folks, with me is Liebe has not only made a hydrogen wheel loader, they've also got a partnership with the hydrogen refueling partner that allows you to put the hydrogen refueling station in as well, doesn't it? Yes, uh, this is very important because this kind of machinery, although it's fairly agile, cannot go to the public refueling station. And we are also planning to do the hydrogen piston engine in excavators and they are even less likely to go to a public station. And so we are developing solutions that, brings the hydro that bring the hydrogen to the machine, into the quarry, into the gravel pit, to the construction site, and we can do fast refilling there. So it's about time we got down and saw a little bit more about this machine. And we know now, folks, we've got the fast refueling and we can get the infrastructure that matters to make this a real workhorse that it should be on the job site. So it's time for us to get down and have a closer look, folks. So we're down at ground level now with Hans. Hans, it is called the H2 Liber X Power. Yes. And so that is really showing us that we've got the power for the future, hasn't it? Yeah, this X Power is uh, coming from the diesel machine. Yep. It is uh, the name for our high efficiency powertrain. So it's a combination of a high efficiency powertrain with the high efficiency hydrogen engine. Fantastic. And of course, power is what we're doing to talk about over here because there's one really, really, really important change in this machine. And it starts over here, Hans, isn't it? Right in here is the big H2O nozzle, but it's actually quite small, isn't it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> so tell us about um, how quickly you can refuel this and compare that to a diesel sort of equivalent. Yeah. It's very similar to to diesel yep. and it will take some 10 to 12 minutes uh, for a complete refill. And that's typical. And, and if it's not completely empty, of course, it's faster. Fantastic. So what are the other changes and where is the actual tank for the H2O to go into? Yeah, it is quite a challenge to have enough uh, hydrogen on the machine. Yep. And in this case, we placed the hydrogen uh, on the rear side of the cab. Rear side of the cab, so this it's is, right uh, here. This, this compartment here. Okay, folks, yeah. so we've got a big hydrogen container in, within there, yes. and that doesn't take away from the visibility of the cab, and it doesn't really take away from the aesthetics, does it? We, we uh, have run the machine now for quite a lot of hours, and our operators say that uh, they can fairly well drive with the mirrors, which would be the typical operation yep. mode. Uh, the drivers do not look uh, behind like that yep. and if it is necessary to see what is behind the machine we would have the standard camera systems. Yeah so it's all the safety systems you expect on, yes. a, on a site with a machine of this yes. size. Yeah. So there we have it folks we've got the machine which is a typical very very successful product line for this for Liebe, used mm -hmm. all over the world mm -hmm. but now it's got the big H2 and basically that means we can go from here on the road to zero but on the road to a big productivity, high performance machine that is not going to really wait any much longer than a diesel now to get refilled at the station. So great to meet you, cheers.